select a section for the basic fare ticket. Thank you very much. So we're getting a bullet train from Shinosaka to Tokyo. Never done this before, very excited. Cost about 150 Aussie dollars and I've got a reserve seat. And we're off already. 30 second boarding process and we're gone. This is cool. fast train about 150 Aussie dollars for my reserve seat I mean it sure beats the trek to the airport going through security and doing the whole airport process I just can't believe how smooth it was to buy a ticket I was so nervous of the process to get on this bullet train five minutes and I was at the platform after buying a ticket it was great really good So much going on, oh my god. One stop and then change trains. Cheeky arm pump. biggest thing I've learned with the trains here, just take your time. Look around, familiarize yourself, follow what Google Maps says, and it's actually really, really straightforward. Now my hotel for the night is a world first. Come check it out. False alarm, check-in opens at three. You'll have to wait a little bit longer. Everyone's got little umbrellas, not JB. JB's getting wet. Sit down for this one. The Uniqlo flagship store in Ginza, Tokyo. Oh my God. Are we ready? This is what dreams are made of. Favorite brand, repping it at the moment. Look at this shop. It's 12 levels of Uniqlo. 12 levels. I can't even fit it all in shot, look. Oh my God. You know we're checking out every level. Just had a solid haul at Uniqlo Ginza. Walk out, bucketing down rain. That's not what we want here. So I went back in, got an umbrella, and now I'm all good. Trekking to a Gyoza store. Apparently it's really good. Rated highly on Google, so we'll go from there. So humid, oh my God. Check this. Look at the size of those. Yes. Probably chilly. I'm gonna smash into this. So hot, but so good. 1300 yen, so about 14 Aussie dollars. Good feed. Okay, now let's go check into this sweet hotel. You're gonna love it. Please use the kiosk machine to complete your check in. Welcome to Hanna Hotel. Please use the kiosk machine to complete your check in. Please select your payment method.
Please insert your credit card. Level 10, I don't reckon I've ever stayed in a penthouse before. Here we go. Robot. Welcome to the crib. All right, what have we got here? This is our friends. Wow, big bed. I think that's a queen bed. That's huge. Nice. The bathroom. I think this one will be interesting. Let's have a look at this. Oh, yeah, that's nice. Oh, wow. That's actually really nice. That's like all you need. Toilet, little thing, and this. Like, you don't even need much more space than that. Like, that's really good. This apparently washes your clothes. I don't know how that works, but I'm going to do that because my shorts stink and my t-shirts. Of course. It is bucketing down outside. That's definitely hindered the plans a little bit, but I'm still going to push through. I'm going to go visit a temple and then go to Electric Town. That looks pretty cool in the photos, so I'm excited to see that in real life, but this rain is just not fun. <sighs> anyway, got to do what you got to do. You may only be in Japan once, so let's go check it out. Whatever I said in the last clip, not happening. Forget about it. It is bucketing down and storms. Don't like it. So I'm going to go watch Thor. Yes, that's right. Come all the way to Tokyo to watch Thor. It's so miserable. And I only have one pair of shoes. <laughs> uh. What a day. So I had a bit of a family mart haul before I got back to the robot hotel. Picked up a green tea. This is actually Guinness World Record green tea. Check that out. So this was 100 yen, I think, which is about one Aussie dollar. Got some water, because I'm severely dehydrated, and a Japanese drumstick. I'm gonna smash into this before bed. Been looking forward to this. But that just about wraps up first day in Tokyo. Oh man, accomplished so much today. I'm absolutely knackered. This is going to be a good sleep. We've got a couple of days in Shibuya coming up. See you in the next one.